security. I love the guy saying security. Security. Where did all these people come from with all these cameras? Okay, so I get it, like I, I get the point of the climate change and I understand that it's a pressing matter and so is our environment, but this isn't the way to do it. And that's not what they're talking about. I don't know what they, defacing a piece of artwork has to do with it. What did, what did Van Gogh do about this? Well, I, yeah, that's basically what everybody's saying. Like, what's the connection between they're just a bunch of spoiled little brats trying to get some attention and honestly they don't even know what they're talking about the oil companies aren't going to care about this they're talking about food they're wasting food first off it's just absolutely ridiculous i don't even know what their point even is i don't think they know what their point even is what they're talking about is more of an economic issue as far as being people being able to afford food what does that have to do with the facing artwork makes absolutely no sense to me the glue that was the biggest thing that i said was the glue is probably made out of some type of petroleum alexa is glue made out of petroleum from sciencesource.com synthetic glues such as super glue are acrylic resins made from petroleum chemicals <laughs> I knew it! Oh, that is so golden. That is petroleum. Pro petroleum <laughs> makes a lot of products. Almost everything that we use is petroleum based. Ford rent, and then they're like mixing like climate they... change. So, but the thing is that it says just stop oil. Just stop oil. Super glued their hands to the wall. This is to stop the drilling of oil in the world. And of course they were arrested and they're going to jail for the next 91,000 years. But, but no, there was no jam. They didn't something. even say anything about fossil fuels. He, this guy's saying yeah, that. Yeah, I didn't even know he's that. He's like, they're, they're, they're saying that they want them to stop the drilling in the world. They didn't even say drilling. Do they even know what that means? And they super glue themselves to the, to the wall? With petroleum oil based glue. I still. None of it makes sense to me. I really love that contradiction. They're not even saying anything about fossil fuels. And they were arrested, but what do you guys think? Will this stop the drilling of oil? No, this, will this stop the drilling of and oil? I, I guarantee it will. How is this? Clear, but, yeah. Security. Oh, it's probably like some little old man that's absolutely horrified. Bad for the poor people. They have to clean it up. I know that's true. They should have made them clean it up. I know they should make them. Well, I'm sure that they'll make them pay a fine. Paintings. You can see right here. They're also super gluing their hands to the wall now, giving a speech. Um, hand to the sidewalk, and she's like, "The police, the police are hurting me." Like, well, yeah, you super glued your hand to the sidewalk. They're not being clear of their objective. Not at all. If, if you're trying to do a protest like that, you really should be clear because you only have one shot at it. And yeah, it went viral. A lot of people looking at it, but nobody has a clue what they're trying to do. It went viral, but it didn't make the same impact as they thought it was going to be. I don't think they know what they're trying to do. Honestly, like I said before, I think they're a bunch of just spoiled little kids just trying to get some attention. And it worked because even we're talking about it, they got all this attention. I think they just trying to jump on the bandwagon. They're hearing stuff about climate change and everything, they just want to get some attention because they're not very clear. And then you have people talking about that they're protesting, that's better for different things. They're protesting climate change, they're protesting oil, they're protesting all these different things. But in their message, they just said people can't afford stuff. 
I don't know if that's oil the right now. Don't get me wrong. Inflation right now, rent control, health insurance costs is astronomical. Something needs to be done about that. But socioeconomic issues. There's a lot of different issues going on. I think their intentions might have been in the right track. The way they went about it though was cruel. And we do absolutely need to, well, first off, this wasn't even in, in America, so. But sure. I know it's worldwide that there's issues going on with the cost and inflation because of the pandemic, but the way that they went about it wasn't right. You know, and also, um, I know that there were other people spraying tomato soup. Climate change protesters spray buildings across central London. There it is. So look at this. They're defacing businesses. They could be defacing small businesses at the cost of the business owner. You don't know. These people could be struggling. They could be struggling to keep the lights on that month. And then you just defaced and vandalize the, the front of their building? How dare you? That's so inconsiderate and selfish. Security. <laughs> but seriously, like, that's so cruel. A business owner is having, you know, a hard time too, and they go to face their, they go to face, that's wrong. It's really sad. It is sad. Yeah, there's, there's other ways to make changes and get your point across than defacing small businesses, defacing, you know, innocent museums and scaring people. And then also using the product that you're, you're protesting to get your protest across. I mean, that's my big thing. If you are protesting fossil fuels, if you're protesting electricity, stop using it. It's plain and simple. If, if you are so dead set against these things, don't use them. But everybody wants electricity. But they're all, I mean, the way I look at it, they're all a bunch of hypocrites. If you guys like more videos like this, so just hit that subscribe button, Engineer Eric Explains, and Eccentricity Studio. Comment below. Let us know what you think. Are these people contradictive or are they making a change? intended to silence.